Hello, RIT alumni and friends. This is Bill Destler, and this is the first in a series of videos that I'm going to be making over the next uh, year or two to reflect the uh, amazing progress at RIT, your alma mater, and this extraordinary institution that's become, I think, such a wonderful asset, both for this community and, I think, for the nation and the world. And I guess the news for this fall, most importantly, is that we're awash with students. <laughs> we have the biggest freshman class in our history, about 2,940 students, more than 200, more than we expected. Our overall enrollment is all the way up to 18,600 students. And in fact, enrollment is growing in all of our programs and at every campus, including our overseas campuses. But not only is enrollment growing, but the quality of the students enrolled is way up. And the diversity of our student body is also way up. We actually have, uh, if you count, uh, African-American, Latino-American, Native American, deaf and hard of hearing, and international students at RIT, they now comprise 41% of the freshman class. And I challenge you to find another private university with that kind of diversity in its entering class. You know, RIT is an extraordinary place, and we're so pleased to be so popular with students. But these, <laughs> these numbers haven't come without some challenges for the institution. Whenever 200 more freshmen show up than you were expecting, of course, we will have challenges in housing them in advising them and providing uh, the entry-level courses that they want to take. But I'm very proud of our community in addressing all of these needs in a very, very quick and, I think, effective manner. And these students seem to be settling in just fine. There's so many other things that are growing at RIT. Research is growing very rapidly. We're up to 62 million in sponsored research last year, the highest number in our history. And there's so many other indications that RIT is becoming, really, the institution of choice for so many families and their children. One example is that uh, you know, RIT was recently ranked the second most innovative campus in the North by US News and World Report. We actually were last year ranked the geekiest campus in America, something we're very proud of. And in fact, just recently, we were named uh, among the top 10 universities in the country, public or private, from which to gain a technology-based degree. These are all things that I think indicate to all of us that RIT is really taking off and assuming its rightful place as one of the great universities in the nation and in the world. More later, as I explore all the ways that RIT is growing, expanding, and doing great things for the future.